Are they gonna let go of her? No, stop! I don't think they're letting go of her. Oh, oh no, they take it. They, they, they've taken her. I don't know what glass they've broken, but they broke some glass, I guess. Welcome back to this Let's Play of Corpse Party. In the last episode, we were trying to get the good ending for chapter two. And it was longer than I thought it was gonna be. We're still going. Uh, we found an antique doll's head and now we're looking for the body. And I believe it's where the custodian closet is, which I don't think is this way. <laughs> okay, it's on the other side, I'm stupid. Okay. Bear with me today as well. I'm not feeling 100%. Allergies are kicking my butt. And I have like the worst sore throat right now. So will I not record a video where I have to talk a lot? You know? <laughs> exactly what I want to be doing. I have a lovely cup of tea. It's in a cute little mug. It's, a, it's like a swan. It's um fruity. It's uh cranberry and raspberry. Let's see. Being British and if you offered a British person a cup of tea and you bought them a <laughs> cranberry and raspberry tea, they would probably break your neck. They would not be happy with you. I don't like regular tea. It's not my thing. I know I should give away my British card because of that, but fruit tea, I don't mind. Is it not here? Oh, is that it? There's an old-fashioned festival doll lying on the ground here. It seems to be missing its head. Pick it up. Yeah, let's pick it up. Thoughts begin to echo in your mind, seemingly from the doll, somehow or another. It's found a way to communicate its sole desire. What the? I hear a voice. Give me back my head. An old, uh, an old stained torso from an antique Japanese festival doll. Acquired antique doll body. As the head and body of the antique doll are joined, it begins speaking more clearly and directly. With a high-pitched voice like that of a child, it slowly repeats several phrases in a cold, methodic, methodical even, and robotic monotone. <coughs> to have killed children so brutally, I was not in my right mind. I did not want them to die. I was scared too. I am so sorry. I am so sorry. So very sorry. I am actually a person. I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. So very sorry. Okay. Did this doll belong to the murderer? Doesn't it kind of piss you off? Like it's just playing around and saying what we want to hear? And it's still sorry. A bit creepy to be honest. We don't need this thing. Wait, don't you think it might come as repentance from the murderer? Count as repentance from the murderer. An antique festival doll bearing the spirit of a man with a guilty conscience acquired Repentant spirit? That was a hard word for me to read, <laughs> and I don't know why. I'll never forgive him, no matter what he says. Okay. Now what do we do? Do we go... I don't know what we do now. We've got the doll. Do we go give it back to, like, the children? I should have read ahead. I'm like semi reading a walkthrough, but like not really. The little ghost boy's gonna be that way, it's really gonna be annoying. There he is, look. You give it back to the. like, these spirits? 
Do they want a doll? They were like little kids. Maybe they do want a doll. I don't know. <laughs> yes? Open your eyes, please! Haven't you ghosts done enough already? I don't know about everything that's happened to you. And yeah, I get that it was really horrible, but you're cursing and killing innocent people who've had nothing to do with any of it. What the hell is that supposed to accomplish, huh? Stop! If you make them mad, they'll shut us out! Come on, you two. I have something you need to hear, okay? Just listen! Ayumi held up the antique doll and let the children listen to the penitent spirits sealed within. Mary? 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 <laughs> oh, sad. You can rest peacefully now, okay? You don't have to keep suffering. The horrible things that happened to you are all in the past. Your loved ones. Your parents are waiting for you. Go to them now. Please? I know you can do it. Let go of the girl. Let go of Suzumoto. Are they gonna let go of her? No! Stop! I don't think they're letting go of her. Oh, oh no, they take it. They, they, they've taken her. I don't know what glass they've broken, but they broke some glass, I guess. Bye bye, Mayu! That sounded squishy. That's not good. Why is it squishy? Ayumi threw the antique doll to the ground in a fit of panic and frustration. I don't think she's happy. Is she? No. Is she? Oh, we're off again. I assume we're going up. I'd go up if I was going anywhere. <laughs> Let's do oh, yep, we are going up. Oh. Oh. Squishy. Oh. <gasps> oh, that matches like chapter one. What the hell? Oh, God. Did they just smush her? I think they just smushed her. Excuse me, I think they smushed her. <laughs> Scooby don't care. <laughs> oh. Shizaki! Shizaki, don't look! Come on, let's get away from here. I can't take this anymore! Oh god, what's she gonna go do? I'm. I'm really starting to lose it. Oh god! <gasps> Is that- that's the murder man! Did he kill him? Or just like, hit him over the head? <gasps> Is he taking- he's taking the body! Murder man, why? Shlop. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> why is he taking the body? Why is he taking the children? Oh, there's so many unanswered questions. Oh yeah, there's evil spirit killed teacher. What? The shelf feels like it's gotten lighter. Oh! So you're really, truly concerned about the safety of your students, are you? Of course I am. But you're just their instructor, no? You have no familiar bond with any of them. You're not their mother. But they're my children. I think I speak for every single one of us at Kisaragi High Academy. Why did I say hi? <laughs> Kisaragi Academy. When I say that we love our children, we care about them just as their parents do. Never underestimate a teacher. Punches him in the face. 
Long as I remember the breakdown. Now answer me this, you little rant earlier suggested that more of my students are here than the two I came with and the one I heard. Is it true? Were the others brought here as well? It is num numerous corporal entities joined us in these closed spaces all at the same time. Counting you, I sense the arrival of nine people. My arm is definitely broken. And all this blood. All those cutting implements on the shelf must have done a number on my back. I wonder how long I was out for. Shinazaki and Kishinuma must be worried. I need to get back to the classroom. That spirit was trapped here, just like us. Succumbing to unbearable feelings of anger and hatred, one victim drawn to harm another. It's not just people trapped in this space, but their sadness and torment as well. It's got nowhere to go, so it just hangs in the halls. We shouldn't be here. I have to get them all back home. Please, everybody, stay safe. I mean, that's a bit late, isn't it? Well, continuing chapter three. So we finally got that for um, chapter two. Blood covered, repeated fear. Continue to chapter three. Now, let's have a look at the ending list. Uh, chapter clear ending. Mayu dies a gruesome death. Was the killer's repentance a lie? Buried alive. Let's we'll go to trap wires, push down the stairs, and read all the web rats. Okay, so we're now on to chapter three, and there's one, two, I don't know why I was counting them like this when it's clearly five. I'm a bit stupid, it's not my fault. So we've got five endings to, to have a look for. Shall we, what shall we do? Um, can you resume? Let's go in chapter three. Oh, you can't resume. New. Let's go. Chapter three. View the chapter three opening. Yes, please. You want to view the opening? I can't take much more of this. What's wrong with this school? She's really cute. Who the hell was that? And why is he here? If we got hit with a hammer like that, we'd be goners. Where's Kurosaki? Don't worry about him. He was just here. We'll run into him any minute now. I'm sure of it. I hate this. I hate this. I don't want to die like that. You saw it too, right? Emmy's body? Her head? Her head was split wide open. Oh god, flash. It had to have been from that hammer. Don't think about it, please. Ooh. What an opening. Oh, we're still going. Damn it, where did everybody go? Oh, what? Look. Fukui, look. The hallway. It, it can't be. The corridor. It grew. What, what is... No, no, no. The other way. Look down the hall. It's black. We can't see a thing. Something's... Uh, coming. What? What? That can't be a good thing. That really can't be a good thing. Oh, it's got squishy again. He seems like he's in pain. It's all squishy. It's uh, very squishy today. <laughs> I wonder how they got those sound effects. going on it's a bit dramatic. 
static. I don't think screaming no is really going to help you, but... What's going on now? Hello? Are we outside? Are we outside? That's got to be a good thing, right? Let's just go home. What's happening? What the hell's going on? I don't know. I'll tell you that. Hello? It was just the... Oh! Don't trust... They killed uh, Mayu. Don't trust... Don't trust it. Give me back my head. I don't have your head. Leave me alone. I don't have your head. Okay. I'm sure not everyone can make it then. <laughs> okay. Yes. Oh, oh Naomi. Uh, hello. Help me. Are you there? Answer me, please. Mum? Mum? Mum, Mum, it's me. I'm in real trouble. Naomi, please. Just let me hear your voice. Please, just say something. I'm your mum, Naomi. God, please, don't let anything have happened to her. Well, creepy. This is really creepy in headphones, by the way. Ugh. I swear to God, if anything like jumps behind me and punches it in the face. <laughs> okay, I get it. Helpful. Okay. Okay, we're back to this again. Seiko, I don't understand. You said we'd make it out of here together. Why would you kill yourself? What happened? What did you see? It really is a pity. <gasps> yeah. Uh, who are you? I'm the spirit of a girl who died here. Do you know what happened to her? I believe your friend was afflicted. Ooh, afflicted. With what? Possession. The curse that holds the school together. Those who are touched by it slowly lose their minds to it. Some people realize this is happening and go to great lengths to prevent it, even taking their own lives. Of course, others just go insane. Sometimes they start hurting the people around them. The exact response to this curse varies quite a bit from one person to the next. That's horrible. Now your friend has passed away. The school, the space, is yours alone. You are its only living occupant. No. You'll be all by yourself from here on out until the day you die. That's a bit disturbing. Well. Well, she... My cell phone does have Seiko's number stored in it, and everyone else's too. <laughs> Careful of those stairs, that's how people keep killing themselves. <laughs> My god, it hurts. 
What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? My leg? It could have been a floorboard, you just like never know. <laughs> oh. Oh, cheese have vomited. <laughs> That's come out of her mouth. I don't particularly want to be seeing that. Put yourself together. You're a tough cookie, Naomi. This isn't like you. That was psycho talking. Okay. Is she going to help you like a spirit? That'd be helpful. Can we have spirit psycho, please? I'm, I'm not tough at all. Psycho. 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 I prefer letting them say it. <laughs> I can't take it. I can't take any more of this. Somebody, please help. You're not sure crying's gonna help. Mommy. Chapter three. You're doing great, Yuka. I'm really impressed how long you've gone without crying. I'm not crying. I'm not. I sense that the other corporal beers, such as yourselves, were brought here as well. Nine in total. Nine poor souls pulled in at once. That would be me and Yuka, Naomi, Yoshiki, Sinozaki, Misui. Shinohara, Suzumoto, Suzumoto and Morishika. In other words, everybody in the room at the time. <laughs> Damn it. So everyone, everybody else in the school too? Yeah. Not exactly. As I mentioned, this is a nexus of close spaces. Your friends are scattered among them. So in essence, they are indeed all in this school, but not in quite the safe space for everyone. Meeting anyone else here may prove difficult. If you should attempt to defy the will of this school to find them, you may ultimately invoke the, its wrath, and that, uh, and that's a fate best avoided. We have to try anyway. Sounds scary. I have to try anyway. He seems like a real, I gotta do what I can to save my friends, power of friendship kind of guy. We appreciate the warning, but we have to try. We'll do whatever it takes to find everyone. Get out of here. Big brother? They're all such good people. They've done nothing to deserve this. And absolutely we'll not give up on them. Just because there's some... Nubulous? Nebulous? Curse that might strike back at me. I swear I can speak English. But there's some words you just don't come across often. It's a rarity to find such righteous determination these days. Be sure you don't lose it along the way. Your desire not to let a single person die. Try to retain that noble spirit no matter what horrors may await. And even if you can't save everyone, you may still be able to alter your fate for the better, even if only for the tiniest of margins. Just don't end up like us. I really like Blue Flame's voice. <laughs> Mm, what is it? What did he mean? The school's wrath. I'm not sure. Is he saying the school has a mind of its own or something? At any rate, we should try to find Miss Yui and the others as soon as possible. And we need to get you home too. If we come across a way out of here, I want you to take it. There must be an entrance way, or an emergency exit, or roof access, or something that leads outside, and if so, you're to go straight home, no buts. Capiche? Okay. Okay, brother. Uh, there's a door behind the shelf, but it seems to exit purely, purely for show. Uh, ugh. It seems to exist purely for show, as if affixed to the wall like a model. There's no way of opening it. Okay, cool. So, we're here again. Newspaper article pinned to the wall. It's from a public a publication called Heavenly Post. Breaking news here ended in murder, but much of the newspaper has worn away. Bodies of the absconded youth were discovered within the Heavenly Host Elementary building on 17th. Now we've read this, authorities forever, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, we've read this before. 
しいドイツで。Oh, what a horrible incident! I remember hearing about this from Shinazaki during one of the candlelight rituals. I guess she did it. I guess she did say it was a true story. I guess. Let's go down this way. Is there anything at the bottom of this classroom? No. I'm trying to get as much stuff as I can. I don't think I've ever played up this far. Okay, so we need a plank for that. There's a rust bucket on the ground, it's empty. We need a plank for whatever's in the bottom. Hello? A, a child spirit. That red dress looks pretty old fashioned. Shut up. Big brother. It's okay, she's gone now. We'll be fine. God. Okay, we can't go up those stairs, so we're gonna go through here. Oh, I didn't read. Hold on, I didn't read what this was. Uh, words seem to be faintly hovering over the fire on the wall. Unfortunately, they keep lightening and darkening, moving and fluctuating, making it impossible to interfere with the message they're meant to convey. Why is it really dark in here? Oh god, why is it so dark in here? Why can't I see anything? Oh, oh god, that's body. That's body. Oh, you have my hands, big brother. Eek! Yuka, Yuka, don't look. Poor Yuka. It's not a prop or anything. It's a real dead body. This is really happening, isn't it? Big brother. A dead body. An actual dead body. Am I going to end up like this too? Are all of us gonna die here? Big brother! Uh, Yuka, it's okay. Come on, Yuka. We're leaving this room. Why is it so dark? I'm definitely saving. When in doubt, do a save, you say. Ooh. There's a corpse sprawled out on the ground, decomposing rapidly. It's clutching a letter in its hand. The letter reads as follows. Dear brother, I regret that we couldn't see one another again before my death, but I no longer have the energy to move, and I'm so desperately thirsty. My tongue's starting to swell up like a sponge, and it keeps cutting off my air. I'd find it fascinating if it would stop nearly... Ugh. I'd find it fascinating if it would stop nearly suffocating me. I just want something to drink anything heck I'd even drink that scary orange juice from the back of the fridge right now but that's that there's not a drop of anything to be found I'm thirsty it's actually making me nauseous weird huh I just hope at least you can make it out of here alive okay cool I'm gonna take a drink cuz I'm also thirsty hmm. tea is good tea is tasty why is it so dark in here? It freaks the shit out of me. Just make sure I don't miss anything. Death is blind. It comes from all souls, regardless of their worth or lack thereof. Okay. Well, that is ominous. Ooh, is that a memoir? Victim memoirs, one of five. Otaki. Mitsuharu, I want to see you again. A ghost told me. Apparently you were brought here too, but we're in different spaces. Even though we're in the same school, I can't see you. Why did this happen to us? I shouldn't be here. I should be in in my... Oh, I should be in my maths one class at prep school. My sister's going to be really mad at me for skipping. I don't think she'd believe this excuse even if I told her, though. I feel like if I can ever find you, I'll be able to get out of here alive. I don't know why, but if we really are in the same school, then I know you must be, there must be a way of getting in contact with you. I'm going to find it. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Is it, was there like no way across here? Was it still? Okay. So I guess we need to find, obviously, every chapter I look for the, the uh, mem memoirs first. And get that ending. The shelves are crammed full of very old, thoroughly yellowed books with unusual titles. 
I think I'm actually going to end this episode here. And in the next episode, we will continue to look for the bad endings. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will catch you in the next episode. Bye.